County. Now away from that, uh, President-elect William Ruto and incoming minority leader Raila Odinga are tonight bracing for a major political battle as the national, at the National Assembly and the Senate as they convene for their first sitting tomorrow to elect their speakers and deputy speakers. And as our senior political affairs reporter Marimi Mwangi now explains, Ruto will be fronting Ford Kenya leader Moses Wetangula against a former speaker, that's 11th Parliament, Kenneth Marende, who will be fronted by the Azimio Coalition. This was after Wiper leader Kalonzo Musioka shifted his ambition to Senate, where he will vie for speaker position to face Kenya Kwanzaa's Amazon Jeffa Kingi. With the dust yet to fully settle from their grueling August 9th face-off, President-elect William Ruto and his main rival, incoming opposition leader Raila Odinga, brace up for yet another showdown on Thursday. The election of Speaker and Deputy Speaker in the National Assembly and the Senate. Ruto's Kenya Kwanza coalition resolved at a parliamentary group meeting in Karen to front Fort Kenya leader Moses Wetangula for Speaker of the National Assembly. Up against Odinga's Azimio candidate for the lucrative job, former Speaker in the 10th Parliament, Kenneth Marende. <laughs> In a Zimio parliamentary group meeting, the coalition resolved that Wiper leader Kalonzo Musioka, who had already picked papers for the job, instead goes for the Speaker of the Senate. Kalonzo, now up against Kenya Kwanza's former Kilifi Governor Amazon Kingi, the Ruto camp also endorsed Uasin Gishu woman representative Gladys Boshole to go for the National Assembly Deputy Speaker's post against Azimio's Faramalim, who held the same seat in the 10th Parliament. Kilifi Senator Stewart Mazayo will be Azimio candidate for Senate Deputy Speaker against Meru's Kathuri Murungi, fronted by the Kenya Kwanza Coalition. The Senators will have to make the decisions tomorrow. It's a very important decision. And of course, uh, we'll be talking to some of them if we can. <clears throat> so... I, the only thing I could add is perhaps an occasion for national reflection, bridge building, if we can. I think that is the work of the Senate. Let me assure Kenyans that I'm equal to the task, and I did a looking, I'm looking focus, uh, forward to, to, to make a change in the Senate. Inclusive of their six nominated MPs, Azimio affiliate parties cumulatively have 174 members in the National Assembly. Against Kenya Kwanza's 162, which is also inclusive of their six nominated MPs. However, a wave of defection from Azimio to the Ruto camp, with the exit of, among others, Maendeleo Chap Chap, Kingi's Power Party, and Ali Roba's UDM Party, alongside a majority of independent MPs, has left the Azimio coalition badly exposed. In the Senate, the Ruto camps begins with a comfortable head start of 34 after Wetangula's resignation, this inclusive of the 10 nominated senators, against Azimio's 32, that includes the 10 nominated senators from its affiliate parties, a number inclusive of one nominated senator from the rebel UDM party. To be elected speaker on the first round, a candidate must garner two-thirds of either house, translating to 233 MPs for the National Assembly and 38 for the Senate. If no candidate garners the numbers on round two, the House goes on a third round of voting, where whoever clinches the majority is declared the Speaker, hinting at the high likelihood of a second round of voting and even a third one, marked with fierce lobbying and negotiations during the elections to be conducted using secret ballot. The speaker must come from uh, the, the Kenya the Kenya Kwanza coalition. And you're confident from your numbers you can deliver them? Confident. We have the numbers and we have no worry that we're going to take the speaker's slot. I've been a senator now three times. So this is my third term. So there's, there's no... I mean, they know, we know one another. And they know me very well. For those ones who have been together for ten years, they know me as a person. They, they know me as a senator. What kind of senator I am, and I believe I can deliver. The lobbying, negotiations and political horse trading officially enters the fever pitch phase as Ruto and Odinga battle for the positions of speaker and deputy speaker in what so far proves to be a tight contest in the two houses. Murumi Mwangi, KTN News, in Parliament. All right, at the back of that story, our big cue tonight. And we ask, who do you think will make a better speaker of the National Assembly?